really no interest in starting up with anybody, but if you want to get smart, then... Um, guys, uh, all I need is, I don't know who's organising it, but you need to be back on the pavement. You can't be in the middle of the road. Traffic's got to get through. Can we all move back on the
NHS, but they all go private. We have to fight this campaign together, and we have to fight, fight strongly. When they say come back, we say fight back, and we also say strike back. When they say come back, we say strike back. When they say come back, we say strike back. It's an irrational move. There's no evidence for it. It's also undemocratic. If the government was interested in critical discussion around these issues, it would have issued a green paper. It didn't do that. It came straight out with the bill. As you know, the Conservative Party has no mandate, nor did the Lib Dems, nor was this part of the coalition agreement. It's not supported by doctors. It's not supported by other healthcare workers. It's not supported by the public. So this is an anti-democratic initiative, as well as being irrational, and as well as leading to increased inefficiency. I think there is no time anymore for critical engagement, and that's the message to our colleagues in this building. The government is not interested in discussion. It's not a rational process, it's a political one. So this is the time now to oppose this bill because following on from PFIs, which have handed over the infrastructure to the private sector, this signals the end of the National Health Service as we know it. So the message is clear. There's, there can be no tinkering with the clauses. This bill must be rejected in its entirety. So do you have any uh, confidence in Lansley? None at all. Their money wouldn't provide they would be able to do operations on, uh, in the hospitals. I absolutely don't want any of that nonsense. You're not in favour? Absolutely not. I've, I've been uh, 30 years as a consultant, I've just retired. And I would have done the job for nothing, clearly. That's right, yeah, that's good. Any willing provide? Are you in, in favour? No. <laughs> If they are going to provide, I want to know how good they are. Precisely. Or anything else. Yes, that's right. right. Well, anybody invited doesn't doesn't sound as though there's going to be much uh, selection. It's, what about it's how, how the cheap they, yeah, the what cheapest. about how cheap they are? Leave them. Does how cheap they are cheap have an influence yeah, on that's it? going to be the problem. That's the, that's the basic problem. Yeah. Yeah. And whether they're um, NHS or private sector, does that make any difference? Say again. Whether they're NHS or private sector providers, yeah. does that make any difference? I don't know. What do you think about um, the health and social care bill? You're going to hear a lot about that today. Yeah. What do you think about it? We are from Walton Forest, East London, and we're fighting to stop the uh, David and Ken destroying our NHS and, and our, our, our clinics. Because we're going to lose our, um, our midwives and doctors and nurses. That's what we're here for, to, to stop the NHS being to, to, to destroy it. Hey, stop.